up guys, welcome to another video of the Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. We last left off. We had just cremated Vesemir. Good old Vesemir. Died in battle defending Siri. So battle on the battle blood on the battlefield. Talk to Avalok about what to do next. But before we do that, let's to pay our respects to a good mentor and friend. I'll remember your teachings always, and the sacrifice you made. Alright, so now that's done, let's go talk to Avalok. Also, I do want to apologize if you hear any firecrackers and they're going on in the background. This Your is being recorded. Has immense amounts of the power. Why has no one taught her to control this? Actually, some did teach her. Clearly to no effect. I'll gladly argue with you about this some other time. Anyways, as I was saying, um, I do apologize for the firecrackers going on in the background. This is being recorded right after 4th of July, so... Yeah. Well, let's talk to Avalok. Still shaking up a bit about Vesemir's death. Wasn't expecting that. I wonder Haven't if it could have been prevented. To talk. Thanks for your help. And for looking after Siri. You will thank me later. Now we must take Cyril from here, Haida. And then gather a greater force. Anyone, everyone we could count on came here to care Morhen. Which is why we must seek the help of enemies. Magic is our best defense against the hunt. We need sorceresses. Arch mistresses of magic. You mean the lodge? Uh, doesn't look like we have a choice. I don't want to involve the lodge. Let's go that. I don't want the lodge anywhere near Siri. Just don't trust those women. What would you have us do instead? Fight alone and die a beautiful but pointless death? Exchange no, him for you. By some miracle, we survived that fight, eking out a measly victory at enormous cost. No more guerrilla warfare. Time to face the enemy in open battle. I've made an agreement with the Emperor. In exchange for you did help, what? the Lodge will be granted amnesty and find asylum in Nilfgaard. That will be our bargaining chip. Triss, I wish to leave today to find the sorceresses. Will you help me? Of course. Even got an idea where you could start. Damn it! Again you planned without even asking what I think. I've had enough of this. I won't be taken somewhere like a bundle. I will not sit and twiddle my thumbs. I am sick of waiting, sick of hiding. You're right. You're right. Prove today you can take care of yourself. Easier to pat someone on the back and hope things will work out than it is to face the truth. Jirel possesses a great power she cannot control. She is a danger to herself, to others. Until she learns to control it, she should remain isolated. First of all, bollocks. Second, if you're going to speak of courage, at least address me directly and not through Geralt. I'm gone. Ah, uh, let her go. I'll go after her. I'll go after her. Better go after her. Wait, she needs time. We must let her resolve her grief on her own. Then we should start training as soon as possible. She must learn to control her abilities. This training really necessary? You saw what happened. She could be a greater threat than the hunt. Fine. We'll stay here a while longer, then join you and Triss in Novigrad. Meet at Dandelion's Inn. Come on, Yen. The sooner we leave, the better. See ya. few days later. <sighs> it's not working, don't you see? Discouraged after a mere eight attempts? Sierra. Eight attempts? How many times must I try? 
As many as it takes. But I'm not getting anywhere. Don't look at me, bro. We shall return to this later. Didn't make it far first time out on the gauntlet either. Oh, Geralt, please, not now. By comparison, the gauntlet was a walk in the park. But that's not the point. What is? Avalar says nothing will come of this until I stop thinking about the battle. But at the moment, I find it impossible to fill my head with kittens and vanilla pudding. <laughs> Tell me, how do you do it? What? Always manage to pull yourself together. Focus. Because he has no, no feelings. He's a witcher. Oh, jeez. Um, relax. Um, we have no time to read. <laughs> Why do I click? I'll just click this. Hmm. Don't know about vanilla pudding. Could work. But nothing picks me up like Lambert's famous homebrew. Suppose it can't kill me. Might as well try. Oh, uh, maybe we should have picked the other one. <laughs> I hate things like that where they give you options you choose because then one. Each one could give you a different. Look at that rat. It killed a meal. It killed a bird. Holy. Oh, that's not a rat. It's a cat. Okay. This is a gigantic rat, but it's a cat. That strong. Maybe you want to try a different method. We've tried at least 20. Wouldn't let it worry you. Not like you need to excel at everything. You're great with a sword, an excellent archer. Leave the magic to mages. Yeah. Pull me another. Please don't tell me we're gonna get drunk like we did last time. <laughs> Girl's like, oh, I'm, I'm down for this. I'm so down for this. Holy moly, that cat ate that bird so fast. Darn it, I didn't get a picture of the cat. Please don't tell me that's Triss. Geralt. Let me Siri. Geralt. Okay, it's Geralt. Wake up. What? What? What's happening? Get up. We must go. I've saddled the horses. Siri, it's the crack of dawn. Where do you want to go? To Velen, Bald Mountain. But a few days till the Witch's Sabbath. And guess who's the guest of honor? Enlighten me. Don't know. Enlighten me. Imlarith. We'll have no better chance to get him. Where do you get this idea? What's gotten into you? I must avenge Vesemir. The Sabbath. It's the perfect opportunity. Imlarith will be drunk among his cohorts, caught up in the revelry. He'll not expect the blow. Hold on a second. Are we trying to kill someone? How'd you learn about the Sabbath? Oh, let's do this one. How do you learn all this? Imlarith? The Sabbath? Avilok. He told me of those who chase us. Claims knowledge itself can tip the scales. Come. We shall talk on the way. Um, alright. Did it, let's go. Lead on. Why can't Geralt have green eyes? Ready? Uh, yeah. Let's go. Really? <laughs> After the Battle of Kaer Morhen, the defenders licked their wounds and mourned their losses, save Ciri who began to plan her revenge. She woke Geralt one night and urged him to travel with her to Velen, to the top of Bald Mountain, where she knew she'd find Imlarith. She had decided he had to die. Is he the one that killed him? That killed, um, Vesemir? I thought the wild hunt always travels and oh they always stay together but it, I don't know I guess maybe they they have they have time off 
I have no idea. Five days later. Wow. Tress and Yennefer must be really getting annoyed of us. We're taking forever. I feel like a cowboy in a trench coat. That is the master armor I'm wearing, by the way. This whole video so far has been entirely cutscenes. <gasps> oh, that's that that place. I went there once. I tried to go up that mountain, but it it it, it wouldn't let me. The men at Crow's That's Birch. why. I spoke of this place. Ard Serbin, home of the ladies of the wood. Oh yeah, the ladies the of the woods. Feared coming here, and the barons thought the ladies of the wood a terrifying tale for naughty children. Incidentally, I wonder how the Baron is. Ah, uh, about that. He found his wife, took her away somewhere far. Anna, she was unwell. A true shame. Let's go. Let's get this done. We must reach the peak. We'll find Imlarith there. The peasant folk of Velen call this night the Feast of Gifts. I have no idea why. Why does the food that they give him meat and that meat comes from sacrifices? <gasps> Avalach claims vanity is Imlarith's Don't do witchcraft, purpose. guys. Vanity? Any foe he faces, he strives to impress. The other one, Caranthir, is said to be secretive and pragmatic. Hardly surprising, given he was Avalach's student. Interesting fact here. I'm running at a solid 60 frames per second, when usually I would drop. Game saved. The white one once served the ladies. But he's an outside! Let them approach. But They've come for the feast. Wouldn't do to cast them out. Didn't come to celebrate. We need to get to the top of the mountain. The gate is shut. You'll not pass. But we fire us down that away, with food and drink aplenty. Sit down beside one, and perhaps this year the ladies will descend. Give us the privilege of seeing them. We'll sit down by the hey, fire. Thank you for the invitation. Be glad to sit down, right? Speak for yourself. Come with me. We're just gonna stare at each other like this. <laughs> okay, we should go. What's this feast? What is this? This celebration. What's it about? Never mind. What do you need to know, wanderer? No need for anger. The white ones serve the ladies as we do now. Dude, that dude is we trigger send happy. Them gifts all year long, and on this night, they repay us with their blessing. I met one of your gifts to the crones, sniveling. Scared to death and about eight years old. Stay calm. <laughs> Why do the ladies need your children? Your children. Why do the ladies need them? We know not and never ask. You don't they know. Eat them. Then let me tell you. Tell us instead what a peasant, his own young and starving, is to do with a wandering war orphan. You're not from here. Don't judge us by others' laws. Said the ladies bestow blessings on you. Aye, for our lives turn thus. First a summer of labor neath the hot sun, then autumn rains, then a winter of death. Then we await spring, when all that is dead is born anew. And from our blood and sweat, the oak bears acorns, at times few, at times a handful. What do you do with the acorns? The Velen elders gather, hold council. Some favor grinding them to spread on the fields for a rich harvest. Others want them given to a cunning woman who'd make medicine for consumption. A handful of enchanted acorns is enough for all Velen. Tis never enough. 
Changing topics. Enough about this. We've got other questions. Mentioned a gate. Said we wouldn't pass. Only the chosen visit the ladies. Every year, young lads and lasses climb the mount, but never more than three. Let me guess. The young lads and lasses don't return. No, they return happy and radiant. But rare is the one who then stays in Velen. Off they go to seek fortune in the wider world. We should go. We should be going. Eager to see the ladies. I share your yearning. We're afire with yearning. <laughs> Geralt, we must get there before daybreak. Go to the tent and stand before Thecla. She's the one who decides who's worthy to face the ladies. All right. That's it. This way. Let's go this way. That's where the map tells us. Hello, deers. I'm guessing you are guys are gonna deers are gonna get eaten. Something tells me that. Wait, is she tied up? Oh, never mind. Okay, if that's a lady, <laughs> I did not want to meet her. Yeah, I wonder what happened to all the um, mutated creatures that were here. Children. <gasps> we said at the same time. Both godlings. Run into them before. They say ghosts are a manifestation of inner fears. Haunting oh, this is interesting. And loneliness grown to vast proportions. That's the girl we kicked out of the tonight. house. It is true, however, that monsters That's the kid who lost his voice. To conquer one's loneliness, one must first conquer one's fears. Some manage to do just that. Interesting. I wonder what this is. Like it does it every time something important happens. He the one who kicked you out of your house? Oh no. Yes. <laughs> well, I must have a word with him. Don't hurt him. Who do you think you are? Kicking Sarah out of her home? Uh, How could you? Wasn't her home. And besides... Please. <laughs> it worked out in the end. If I'd not left Novigrad, I'd never have met Johnny. <sighs> Fine. I'll let you off this time. <laughs> See you found your lass. So what brings you here? We're heading up the mountain. Any advice? Yeah. Don't do it. Johnny says the crowns aren't to be fooled with. You've barely found your lass. Didn't find her just to lose her now, did you? We'll be fine. Do as you will. Path up the mountain starts the other side of the gate, so you'll need the key. Old Thecla only gives it to those she deems worthy of the lady's presence. Thanks for the advice. We should go. Good luck. Visit us sometime. We've a place not far from here. We'll be certain to stop by. So long. I'm guessing that's a new quest, or no, it's a character entry. Oh, so so we've met the girl we kicked out and almost want we want to burn the stove. I kind of feel bad maybe for kicking her out. But then again, it would have changed maybe a bit where she would never been there. And I would I still need to get that reward from that dude though. You know what? We're going the wrong wrong way. We gotta get the key, and I have a pretty well enough idea where that key is, because I've been here before. It's in that tent, and I kind of have an idea where the key is, because I walked in here once. And I might have taken the key already. Well, come on, come closer, girl. Jeez, what's that on her face? What's she like? Narrow hips, sparkly eyes, a striking feisty lass. Never had a man. Never mind. Got me answer. I choose you, girl. This night you shall see the ladies. Um, let's see what do we pick. I'm going with her. If she goes up the mountain, I go with her. <laughs> What else is the cat drugged in? It's grey and veiny, got a scar and eyes. Grey and butter. veiny. I <laughs> stinks of clotted blood and corpses. Plus it's old and infertile. I reject ye, freak. The girl will ascend alone. Okay. 
appearances can be a, a deceiving, um, worthy. Uh, let's do this. You misjudged me. I'm worthy as anyone. Girl, he's sprier than any youth. Only smells like corpses because he kills monsters. And he'll kill any who stand in his way. Perhaps I was mistaken. Perhaps there's life in him yet. Uh, By ancient right, you may appeal my choice. But to do so, you must best the challenge. Oh, no. Ah, oh, great. I accept the challenge. <laughs> Come. What's the challenge? Kill the old woman? Gladly. Or jump off the old cliff. Holy moly, I was exactly right. Look this over. A coin from days of yore. Falker burns on its reverse, so they call it the Defiers Or. We gotta fetch it. Great. Now, bring me the coin. <laughs> 